Hello friends, let's unbox iPad Air 2 which I recently bought from Amazon.com You might be see that the sticker of Amazon and this is the front side of iPad Air 2 and this is the side view in which iPad Air is written and the upside is blank and the down the bottom one is also blank side and the right side is also iPad Air written there and on the back side you might be able to see that the iPad Air 2 is written the 16 GB version Wi-Fi plus cellular and this is the price 41,900 rupees made in June 2016 and let's get ahead let's get started I'm using pen for unboxing this box and now I scratch it up because friends first I was planning for the Wi-Fi version only but after that I thought that uh, it's not a good deal because if you go if you're going to get cellular version definitely you are going to be portable Otherwise, if you are going to take only Wi-Fi person, you have to fix your butt inside the room and do everything from your room itself. Otherwise, if you are taking the cellular with Wi-Fi person, you are a portable person. And your iPad with you is a portable. Here is the iPad Air 2, take a look, the front side is white colored, but the real color is golden the behind. And this is the charger which comes with iPad Air 2. And this is the SIM ejector pin which is given by the company for ejecting your SIM cards from your device means iPad Air 2 and these are some papers starting guides and whatever it is warranty cards and this type of things and there's no this these are the stickers means two Apple classic stickers you might use this on your bikes or other things and this is the USB cable USB to lightning cable and that's it and this box is empty nothing inside all empty box let's remove the box and check your iPad Air 2 and now let's remove the cover means it's covered with a light polythene for somewhat what you can say it's protection and now I have, re I have removed the polythene and this is your dazzling iPad Air 2 the back side it's iPad written here and on the left side there's nothing on the top you might be able to see that there's a camera in the front top and the bottom this home button and on the left top there's volume rockers up and down and there's a mic these are volume rockers mic and these at the bottom of the right side this is same tray 
and next this is the these are the speakers at the bottom and the middle is the charging port and these are the cameras and this is cellular bar used for releasing signals and is receiving it and this is the power button the on off it is on the top of the ipad and let's put it on now see how much time it take to turn on i'm turning it on in the first time and you might be able to see now it's hello it's on i think it has taken 6 to 7 seconds and now i will be back after doing some settings okay now i'm ejecting its sim tray to put my sim inside it and it is the sim tray is on the right side of the ipad air 2 and now gently push it with your sim ejector pin and now i am putting it pulling it out and now it's out this is the sim tray and now i'm going to put inside the reliance zero means the sim of reliance zero now i have already fixed it fixed my sim inside the tray and put the sim facing down means the plate of sim must be facing down and now put it inside the tray and push gently so i'm back after my settings of ipad air 2 and now i have already set fingerprint in the home screen now i have to press the home screen and put finger for 2 1 or 2 seconds after that it's get on okay now come here this is assistive touch button i love this and here in the corner you might be able to see that there is a geo for glt it has two point network and now gets inside the settings as the settings and now it's visible i think visible that geo 4g lte i'm using the network this the lte version and now there is a mobile data option and personal hotspot bluetooth wifi airplane mode everything here it is and if you want this assistive button means this assistive button on the top of the screen you you have to go in general i am already inside it go inside accessibility and now here you can find assistive touch in here you can see assistive touch is on now customize menu level here i have selected only one button home button but if you want some more just go to mode below and add one icon is plus the second one tap on the plus you can find a large number of options you can set any one of these means if you want control center device custom notification center example take an example lock screen okay how it's okay and tap outside it's done tap on this now you can see there is two option home button and lock screen if you tap lock screen it will go on to lock okay now tap on home button it is on home now again tap on this button it's two and now double tap on this now the 
we use can see the whole bunch of softwares which are which are running it will pop up now tap on this now I'm going to, I'm going to remove this one I don't need I will this that's why I will tap minus and it's done now come back and now check check the storage what's the storage inside general I'm already inside general and now you can see storage and iCloud tap on that and now you can see here see here that use the storage 2.66 GB and available storage 9.27 GB now we have to see manage storage if you want to remove the apps in the manage storage storage in iCloud this manage storage and you can see long list of apps if you want to remove these apps just tap on the app and you can find here the amount which is amount of storage which is captured and now delete app and now you can remove this app delete is going to clear the area thanks friend thanks for watching my video like it if you like or or if you don't like it please give a dislike don't forget to comment thanks for watching